Now, second uh, forecasting technique of population is our geometric increase method. And this geometric increase method is mainly suitable for fast growing city that is young city that is in which there is the rapid growing of population due to migration due to industrialization so all lot of things because of the facilities that are increasing in certain place uh, such a, a population is increased in those places so in such case geometric increase method is used and this is mainly used for rapidly uh, growing uh, place or uh, young city young city for young city uh, so this is for young city uh, due to uh, due to migration or industrialization so this is this may be the case of geometric increase method and uh, in this method this is a uniform growth rate method a uniform uniform uh, growth rate of population is assumed is assumed and this is and this uh, is very similar analogous or similar to analogous to compound interest so in com likewise in compound interest this is similar method like compound interest and this is mainly mainly used in our country as a forecasting tool so so we will go through the formula of this so if we have p1 as a population after a decade and p0 as the population in initial decade so then we can write p1 as p0 plus r percentage of p0 so if we can solve this we will receive the formula of p1 as p0 1 plus r by 100 to the power 1 Likewise, for second decade, we can write P not P two equals to P two equals to P one plus R percentage of P one. This will, when solving, will yield to P not sorry P one one plus R by hundred power one. So, if we substitute the population in P one from this expression, we will get P not. 1 plus r so we have substituted p, p1 equals to p naught 1 plus r by 100 power 1 likewise this is this value so if we solve this we will get so in solving this we get p naught 1 plus r by 100 1 plus 1 it has it added and it will get to likewise generalizing generalizing we will get pn equals to p naught 1 plus r by 100 to the power n so this is our main expression for geometric increase method and where your pn is the population in nth decade and p naught is the last known population last known population and your r is your assume growth rate assume growth rate of population so r is your assume growth rate population so this r shall be calculation is uh, it's important here so r can be calculated by arithmetic arithmetic increase method method or using geometric 
increase method method by geometric mean so it can be geometric mean so it can be calculated by by arithmetic increase method it can be calculated by arithmetic arithmetic mean so in this it can be calculated by r equals to in arithmetic uh, so in arithmetic in mean method r can be calculated by r1 um, plus r2 plus r3 plus so on to plus rn divided by n likewise in geometric increase method it can be calculated by r equals to r1 multiplied by r2 multiplied by r3 multiplied by so on to rn to the power to the power 1 by n to the power 1 by n where n is your number of rates n is your number of rates so this is the way this is the technique for uh, determining geometry in case method and when we do the calculations uh, numerical uh, problem in geometric in case method and this will be very much clear of here in uh, this part we are given a uh, question that we need to determine the population in 1990 uh, and 2020 by geometric in case method for, for from the following sets of data available in year and population and the year has been given in decades so the solution of this question is will be solving out so here year is given likewise population has been given and the year is 1930 1940 1950 1960 1970 and the population has also been given as 25,000 uh, 28 uh, sorry 28,000 uh, 34,000 and likewise uh, 42,000 and 47,000 so this is your population likewise you need to assess other column as well now um, we are doing through geometric increase method first thing we have to remember in geometric method the population is forecasted by this formula pn equals to p naught 1 plus r by 100 to the power n where r is your assumed growth rate method so you this can be determined using arithmetic mean or you can use by geometric mean so uh, so this is growth rate so you need to first find increase in population increase in population you need to find increase in population so this increase in population can be assessed here so here 1930 1940 the increase in population in the in uh, 10 year that is one decade is 3000 that if we assume p1 this p2 this p3 this p4 this and p5 this so this is 28000 minus 25,000 that is P2 minus P1 so P3 minus P2 we can assume this as 6,000 so get 6,000 likewise P4 minus P3 we will get um, 8,000 likewise uh, P5 minus P4 will uh, 47,000 minus 42,000 this will yield as 5,000 so this is your increase in population you get this as X1 X2 x3 x4 so this is your increase in population so in this method we need to find the percentage increase in population so we need to know the population increase in population in this case so this have to be determined here here in 10 decade sorry in a decade that is in 10 year the population has been increased to 3000 and we need to in, uh, determine the percentage increase population so in first decade that is in 1940 the population increase is this x1 is your increase in population divided by original population p1 so x1 is your 3000 the original population in first case is 25000 
that is uh, to be into 100 percentage that will yield to be 21 sorry 12 percentage so and in second case we have x2 by similarly p2 this is will x2 is in case in population 6000 in divided by 20,000 uh, that is 6000 and divided by uh, 28,000 into 100 percentage that will give us 21.42 percentage likewise in third x3 by p3 like 8000 divided by 34000 so this into 100 percentage this will give us 23.53 percentage x4 in fourth case we will give uh, x4 by p4 that uh, x4 is 5000 divided by p4 is 42000 into 100 percentage so this will uh, this will uh, yield to be 11.90 percentage so this is our assumed rate of growth of population so this is our rate one this is rate two this is rate three so this is rate four so this is rate and we are calculating the individual rate in each decades now we need to determine the uh, assume this r assume growth rate of growth uh, rate of population calculation calculation so this r can be determined using any of the method uh, we have previously mentioned that uh, it can be determined using arithmetic uh, mean or it can be determined by geometric mean so in this case i will be showing both and uh, using any of the one one value okay so using uh, in assuming first are using arithmetic uh, arithmetic mean so if we using arithmetic mean and if you using second is your geometric mean if you are using this so if we if we are using arithmetic mean we will get the value of r as r1 plus r2 plus r3 plus r4 by 4 because here there are four number of rates that is four number of decades okay so here r1 is 12 percentage 12 plus 21.42 plus 23.53 plus 11.90 divided by 4 and it will uh, yield to be 11, uh, sorry 17.21 percentage likewise if we do by geometric method we can get r equals to uh, r1 into r2 into r3 into r4 to the power 1 by n so this is number of rates r1 is your 12 plus 21 sorry into 21.42 into 23.53 into 11.90 to the power 1 by 4 so if we solve this we will get 16.38 percentage as our rate okay so this is our rate now we need to assess the population uh, in the year 1990 and in the year 2020 by this um, method so population in 1990 can be uh, population in 1990 can be assessed by using population uh, population in uh, last known population uh, 1 plus r to the power 100 to power n so here we are using the value of r using arithmetic mean method we can use any of the method uh, um, by um, the um, by but here in this case i i will be using arithmetic mean as the value of r so p naught is your last known population this is your p naught because it is last known population so it is 47000 1 plus r is your uh, assume growth rate that is assessed through uh, either maybe geometric mean or arithmetic mean in this case i will be using arithmetic mean 21.5 sorry 17.21 divided by 100 so uh, so number of decades is your 70 1980 is one decade 1990 is two decade so i will be putting this so solving this we will get uh, the value of uh, this uh, uh, population 1990 as 64,570 uh, 64,570 numbers 
likewise population in 9, uh, 2020 will be p naught 1 plus r to power r by 100 to power n so if we solve this we will get 47000 1 plus weight r is your uh, assume growth rate of so uh, number of decades so in this case number of decades is 2020 so it is five number of decades so if we solve this we will get the population in 2020 by geometric in case method to be uh, 103974 numbers that is 1,3974 number of people so this is the way we can solve the geometric increase method so thank you so guys if you think this video is useful you can like and share to your friends and for such videos you can subscribe to this channel as well. Thank you and we will meet in another video soon.